Welcome to Technogram by Reddington, our podcast where we drive tech dialogue for a digital future. I'm Janice Riglini. I lead the communications and media at Reddington. Today we have Zubin Chakpar, who is the business group leader at uh, Microsoft for Modern Work and Surface. Zubin, thank you for being here, and I'm going to give you a chance to say your name as you would. No, no. <laughs> Janice, that was perfect, and first of all, it's a pleasure to be here. The name is Zubin Chakpar. And I get to work with cool technologies across uh, this great area that we support, uh, particularly around modern work and surface devices. One of them that I'm holding in my uh, hand over here, <laughs> my, my, uh, yes. my lap out here. Yes. Right. Uh, I like to go dive into it straight away, Zubin. So, digital transformation has been accelerating across all the industry, and in this process, one of the top concerns has been about cybersecurity. In fact, according to a recent report, the cost of a data breach per customer in the Middle East is around seven million U.S. dollars. I mean, that's a staggering figure. So, in this regard, how is Microsoft ensuring the customers are protected and they're able to improve uh, threat detection, response, and prevention capabilities? Yeah, no, it's uh, and thanks for calling out those numbers. It's important for our listeners to understand that there is actual financial risk happening right now for not having the right level of security and protection even as we try to leverage these technologies to digitally transform, as you noted. Now, your question is how Microsoft is addressing this, and I brought some statistics and figures with me, of course, like any <laughs> business group leader would do, but I would highlight at the beginning that Microsoft is investing very heavily right now to come up with technologies and leverage technologies and further technologies to the tune of $1 billion a year where we're putting to R&D and other areas to make sure that we can address the challenge together with wonderful partners like yourself. So very important to understand that that type of investment sits on top of the 200 global centers and data centers that we have across the world. So this combined gives us a unique footprint where we're able to see trillions of signals that we can address, categorize, and make sure that we're protecting our customers at the end of the day. Um, like I'd love to give you some examples, if we have time for that. If, if of that course we do, yes. Of some of the customers in our region here in the Middle East that we are working together with Reddington, with Reddington's partners to protect. Like, for example, Emirates MBD, mm -hmm. uh, my card over here, uh, my, my credit card, they're a wonderful bank. They serve over 14 million customers in 13 different countries. I didn't even realize they were outside of Emirates, but 13 different countries. And they are they're, they're leveraging some of the technologies from Microsoft, like M365, which are technologies that help with productivity and also security as well to the end user, plus our Azure solutions for, for around productivity, collaboration, and security. And they're using that to ensure that they have compliance, both across regulatory and industry standards. They're also leveraging it for customer services. They're using it to safeguard their, their sensitive data, particularly time-sensitive data, and prevent unauthorized access. So they're protecting their customers, which ultimately are you and me, and in many cases, working with um, Emirates MBD. And, and another one that I want to highlight for you is Majid Al Futem. I'm guessing you yes. know them. They're, they're across everywhere. They have financial services. They have retail experiences fun experiences that I take my kids to as well. So they're, they're a great organization. And here they're actually in 15 different markets. So consider all the different markets that they're operating across the Middle East, Africa, and even Asia as well too. So here they, they uh, are spending their, um, their focus on critical workloads. So these are ones that where they need to back up their data. They need to retrieve their data, site recovery. Uh, they use a Azure Key Vault to make sure that they're able to uh, encrypt and unencrypt data as well too. And they have a security center as well. So these are all important areas, customers that are using technology, particularly from Microsoft and our partners, to make sure that they're staying secure on behalf of their customers. That's great. Thank you so much for sharing those examples. Um, so in such a scenario, I also want to touch upon a little bit about the partnership that you have with DigiClass. So can you elaborate on how, are, how can organizations and partners uh, leverage the partnership between Microsoft and Reddington's uh, managed security services provider, DigiClass, to elevate uh, cyber postures? Absolutely. So first of all, security is complex, right? Just, just a lot of data and a lot of signals that are coming uh, through the internet. Now, everything is getting attached to the internet, through on-prem as well, to, to get data sources coming in. This is IoT. These are um, devices. These are individual desktops, you can also bring your own devices, as, as many of us know, and you're connected to the environment. So from there, you need to be able to have a viewing pane, a view of the overall uh, environment. And this is where DigiGlass comes in from Reddington. It helps both our customers and our partners to be able to leverage the Microsoft technologies to get the signals in place so that they can react. So they have 